I am Dr. Vijay Vishwanathan. I am the head and chief diabetologist at the Professor M. Vishwanathan Diabetes Research Center uh, at Chennai. So, the three talks, important talks I am giving at this RSSDA meeting in Ahmedabad 2018. The first talk is on tuberculosis and diabetes, where we have done some very interesting and uh, important work on screening people who are attending the tuberculosis unit. Uh, for TB uh, treatment and when we checked them for diabetes, we found that nearly 50% of the patients attending the tuberculosis unit in an urban uh, tuberculosis unit setting in the city of Chennai uh, were found to be diabetics. So, in an earlier study about 5 years ago, we had shown that about 25% of TB patients uh, are diabetic. So, it is very important that if the Prime Minister and others are talking about preventing TB, eradicating TB in India, I think we need to screen every TB patient for diabetes. Because in another study, we showed that if TB patients have diabetes and if we do not treat the diabetes properly, the sputum conversion is delayed and there can be failure in treatment of TB. So, it is very important to screen all TB patients for diabetes and, you want to and this is the, based on the uh, moral of the story, so, um, the study which we did how do you want recently. To, how do you want to talk about the second the talk is course. on yeah. preventing amputation. So, you know, so we find that a lot of amputations are happening in India yeah. because patients do not wear the right type of footwear. If a person has got an ulcer in the foot, he does not use the right type of footwear and it, the ulcer does not heal and then it finally ends up in an amputation. So, in addition to the surgeon's work of surgical debridement and so on, it is very important that people with diabetes who have a foot ulcer are provided the right type of offloading footwear. So, that is the top talk uh, which I am going to give as a second talk at the RSSDI because we have developed some nice offloading footwear at our hospital the MB Hospital for Diabetes in Chennai and that is what I am supposed to be speaking at this meeting. The third talk is on the legacy effect and on the metabolic memory uh, which I am going to give at this meeting. Now, we find that people who neglect their diabetes in the first few years compared to people who take proper care of their diabetes in the first few years. If you compare these two groups, the latter group that is the people who take care of their diabetes properly in the first few years, they land up in less complications. That is because of this concept of metabolic memory, the way it is called as legacy effect, where we find that if you do not control diabetes properly in the first few years, it will lead to certain changes inside the cell, intracellular changes, so on, which will become permanent and you cannot reverse it even if you control your diabetes after a period of poor control. Whereas, if you control diabetes right from day one, then that effect of good glycemic control stays on for a long time. And this advance, advance on study has clearly de demonstrated the benefit of keeping the HbA1c at 6.5 percent or below. And in this study, they also showed that glycoside was used and that has got an edge over other uh, oral hypoglycemic agents in trying to prevent the complications of diabetes, especially diabetes kidney disease. So, these three important topics are going to be discussed by me at the RSSDI 2018 at Ahmedabad, which is happening today and tomorrow. Thank you.